In order to make Ashland City Schools facilities safe, we're going to utilize hypochlorous acid to use in fogging of our classrooms and our larger areas in our facilities. It's a very simple process that is made using household items. You use vinegar, tap water, and non-iodized salt. So we're going to kind of show you today how we're making that. Uh, our custodians in our district will be able to make this in five to eight minutes, load up our paint sprayers, and be able to fog our rooms in the evening when staff and students are not in the building. So it will be a very uh, clean process and it, this disinfectant, hypochlorous acid, is food safe. You could spray it on strawberries and eat them right away. Uh, so we're excited about how safe this is for humans. Keeping in mind that when we do these foggings of our rooms, there will be nobody in those classrooms. Um, it allows it time to sit and kill anything that would be in the room uh, that would be a virus or any other disease uh, that could be on a hard surface. Um, and it is safe for plexiglass and wood. It's not going to deteriorate any handles or hardware in our school buildings. So we're excited about that process. So I'm going to show you how we're going to make it. You're going to use a liter of tap water in our Ecolox machine. We're going to do two grams of non-iodized salt. So there's one gram, there's two grams. We're also going to use a teaspoon of distilled white vinegar to balance out the pH, get it in there. That simple, I'm going to put our lid on and in eight minutes we're going to have Electrolyzed water is going to create hypochlorous acid, very human safe. It's a very, very powerful disinfectant. This product is going to come out smelling like chlorine pool water, but it is uh, really going to help keep our buildings clean. So our hypochlorous acid is complete in our Ecolox machine. I'm going to take our litmus paper and test the pH. So you want your pH somewhere between 4 and 6 and five is the yellow color that you'll notice here and we've we've met that uh, once again this kind of smells like pool water um, but it's very human safe I could spray some food right now and uh, go ahead and eat it so we would take this batch of hypochlorous acid if I had our paint sprayers here which would be what we're going to use to spray our rooms I would fill that with this liter that we made. Um, we've actually filled this spray bottle. Um, so the EPA asks you to either fog a room and let it sit or spray an area and uh, let it sit for 10 minutes and then wipe it down. So for example, I'm gonna use this door handle. I'm gonna spray it down. We would obviously let that sit for 10 minutes. Um, what you don't know is I sprayed this about 15 minutes ago with this already. So I know that this is double clean. Um, I'm going to wipe that down. It uh, has no damage to our hardware. We're going to be doing this day in and day out. Um, so we're excited that we can put this in a sprayer, disinfect, and uh, we will be able to, to have a very healthy environment for our staff and students.